I'm Darren Cullen, I'm an artist and I make political agitations and satirical artworks mostly. This project that I'm doing at RRU is an advertising display card for The Sun. Um, it's meant to look like it's made by The Sun and I'm going to send this out to The Sun's advertisers and it's a new pricing system. To have your advert placed next to a terror story will actually cost a bit more because there are benefits for advertisers being placed next to terror stories. So. That headline is there to get your attention long enough to show you the advert. So every horrible thing that happens, the sun is making money out of that. It's making a link between the business model of tabloids, which is advertising based, and the conflict of interest in their reporting on terrorism and other kind of terrible events like that. The reason I chose the sun was because it's got a long history of demonising communities such as the Irish in the 70s and 80s and Muslims since 9-11. These are like deemed as suspect communities because they're thought to have some kind of latent support for terrorism. And so The Sun has consistently played on those fears of, of the, the rest of the community about, about those people, but it gets away with it because it does it in a kind of like a little bit of a cheeky way or something. Because of its readership, it has the ear of the British government. And I think The Sun is as destructive, possibly quite a lot more destructive than papers like The Daily Mail because it has such a high readership. If terrorism is good for their business model and terrorism makes their money, then we have to be suspicious of anything they say about how we should combat terrorism because it's not in their interest to stop terrorism. It makes them rich, so why would they want to stop it?